Hello and welcome to this lesson about stylistic devices so let's dive right in. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to this channel and also don't forget to buy the best merch from my store from which I put a link in the description of every lesson and don't forget that the main objective of this channel is to provide the best information about all things related to English grammar to you. Stylistic devices. Stylistic devices are linguistic techniques used by writers and speakers to enhance the aesthetics and impact of their communication. These devices add depth, creativity, and uniqueness to language, making the content more engaging and memorable. Here's a tutorial on some common stylistic devices in English grammar with examples. 1. Alliteration. Alliteration is the repetition of the initial consonant sounds in a series of words within a sentence or phrase. It adds rhythm and musicality to language. Examples. 1. Peter Piper picked a peck of pickled peppers. 2. She sells seashells by the seashore. 2. Simile. A simile is a figure of speech that compares two unlike things using, like, or, as. It creates vivid and imaginative descriptions. Examples. 1. Her smile was as bright as the sun. 2. He runs as fast as a cheetah. 3. Metaphor. A metaphor is a figure of speech that directly compares two unrelated things, suggesting that they are alike in some way. It adds depth and symbolism to language. Examples. 1. The world is a stage, and we are all actors. 2. Time is a thief that steals our youth. 4. Hyperbole. Hyperbole is an exaggeration used for emphasis or to create a dramatic effect. It makes language more vivid and engaging. Examples. 1. I've told you a million times to clean your room. 2. Her bag weighs a ton. 5. Personification. Personification gives human characteristics to non-human entities, such as animals, objects, or concepts. It makes descriptions more relatable. Examples. 1. The wind whispered through the trees. 2. The flowers danced in the gentle breeze. 6. Onomatopoeia. Onomatopoeia is the use of words that imitate or resemble the sounds they describe. It creates auditory imagery. Examples. 1. The bees buzzed around the hive. 2. The thunder roared in the distance. 7. Oxymoron. An oxymoron is a combination of contradictory or opposing words. It adds complexity and intrigue to language. Examples. 1. Bittersweet memories. 2. Deafening silence. 8. Anaphora. Anaphora is the repetition of a word or phrase at the beginning of successive sentences or clauses. It adds rhythm and emphasis. Examples. 1. I have a dream that one day. I have a dream that one day. 2. We shall fight in the fields and in the streets. We shall never surrender. 9. Parallelism. Parallelism involves using similar grammatical structures or patterns in a series of words or phrases. It creates balance and symmetry in language. Examples. 1. To succeed in life, you must work hard, strive for excellence, and never give up. 2. She enjoys reading, swimming, and hiking. Benefits of using stylistic devices. 1. Engagement. Stylistic devices capture the audience's attention and make content more interesting. 2. Memorability. Unique and creative language is more likely to be remembered. 3. Expressiveness. Stylistic devices allow for nuanced and imaginative communication. 4. Aesthetics. They enhance the beauty and elegance of language. Mastering stylistic devices can elevate your writing and speaking making your communication more compelling, expressive, and impactful. And that is all for this lesson until we meet again. Don't forget to support this channel by like, share and subscribe and also to buy the best merch on my store in which I give a link in the description below. This is English Grammar Audio Tutorials signing off.